Hello everyone, as you read the title before, what I'm going to show you right now is how to install Android TV apps in your Fire Stick. To be able to do this process, we're going to need two things. First of all, we're going to have to enable the developer options from our Fire Stick. It's something very easy, I'm going to sh about to show you right now. And the second thing is uh, the method change a little bit. So you have to uh, like turn on the unknown sources app in many different things, you know, and as you can see, it's a UI. It's just like, because the Fire Stick is an Android, just it just has a UI on the top of it. Uh, and as you can see, I'm here. So you go to settings, you go to my Fire Stick, about, and this right here, this section, you start to click the select button for many times as possible and it will actually let you know when you unlock the um, developer options in this case it's telling me that i don't need to do this because i already did it but i'm showing you the process if i go back and i go you make sure this debugging usb a adv um debugging so it's on and then whatever application you download for um for now on you're gonna have to turn on and off to allow them to work so as you can see right here i already um i already uh download the downloader but i'm gonna act like if i'm gonna download from scratch like if you don't have it in your fire stick so what you can do is go to the app store from amazon and uh get in there and try to type it so in this case i have it here but we're gonna act like let's let's suppose that I don't have it. So I go, and the reason why I have it is I did previously something that I needed before. So I didn't want to start from scratch. So anyway, I'm showing you the way. Like let's suppose that I don't have it. So you go to Amazon App Stores to the search box and you type D, and oh, you only have to type D. You will see downloader in the bottom. In this case, I will go to the app. I have it, so when I click it, it's gonna open. But in your case, you don't, have, you don't have to click on the arrow to download it. You wait. When it's installed, you can uh, type this uh, link that you see in the screen. You can pause the video and take it. So I will type it myself also over here. That way you can see uh, how to type it and what to type. And then once we finish typing, so we're gonna go to the, uh, we're gonna tell it to go to to get the download that we need to get so it's pretty simple uh, as you can see it's HTTP you know and then like you have to make sure you type everything correctly that's the only thing you have to be careful when you're typing so why I'm doing this because it is uh, nice to have uh, an Android TV like and sometimes the, the don't get me wrong the Amazon App Store is cool but it has some limitations so i want to take you to the next level and make you able to install application that you're not able to install with amazon so this is a cool uh, discovery i did so i wanted to share with you guys in youtube like uh, at, at free you know no cost uh, i mean when i find something good that's the purpose of my channel so you hit go once you um you finish typing and it will take you to this web so you scroll down and then you go to a clean space on the download bar right there. No tricks, nothing is wrong with this, so you can do it safely. So you click on it and it will start downloading it. So once it's downloaded, so it will take you to this um, page. So you press the arrow down and right to make sure it's in the install section. So we click and install. And then we wait, we let it load and we wait until installing. And once it's installed, so you're ready to uh, rock on this. So once again, you hit done here, and then you move to the delete section because you don't want that package to stay there and fold your, uh, make your uh, storage space less than before. So, you already got the application so sure, you don't need to uh, save the package so you go again you go to the applications and when you go to the application you will see it down when you scroll down you will see orange arrow 
that's the application we already download so that is the main application we're going to be using to install the application with this R and the ones that is able to um, let you install like Android TV applications so as you can see right here you accept the, um, the you allow when you do that I will show you an error like so first thing I had to do is enable this app in order to for me to use this application uh, to install the other application I should go back to settings and turn on the unknown sources uh, on this application so I will do that as you'll see right now when I type what I'm looking for and in this case I needed an application for streaming uh, a player that it was only available on um, iPhone um, a streaming player it's called Smarter Pro I needed that um, streamer but I didn't uh, want the version that it was available um, you know I needed the light version the same application that is on the iPhone I needed on my fire stick so in this case I just type it and I will see here so there are two but the one that is on the iPhone is this one and I really believe that is very good so that's why you see the rating is four stars not so I need this application so I was not able to install it because it's only available for Android TVs so right now I'm, I'm able to install it and it, it, work, it will work good so that's what I'm trying to show you so you see this message this is the hero that I'm, tr I'm talking about I should go previously before use any application of you download you have to go back to settings as you can see right here scroll down to the application you download and turn on the unknown sources so that way i can install i can install any applications from this app that is simulates like the play store but you don't have to actually sign in with your google account on it you just can straight download any application i think it's a cool option i think it's a good very good option to install applications that you're not able to install on your um on your fire stick so I did include the process to install this in case you probably need that application. So the process is the same. You'll see this screen when you're trying to install, you tell it to install. And then once it's finished, so we're ready to go to just the application as, as you want. As you can see right now, I already opened the application and it's working correctly. I don't have any problems. So right now I'm going to show you, please don't forget to uh, like and subscribe to, and I will be able to keep making videos like this. As you can see right here, we got the Google app, something that you cannot install from, uh, from the Amazon app store. So you can see right here, it has WhatsApp, it has Facebook. So I'm going to download Facebook right now. And then you can see uh, what I was talking about. You can install basically any like Android TV applications. Uh, you can download it here. So I'm going to prove it uh, that you can install them. It's not like just talking. It's like doing it. So you can certainly know that what I'm talking is real. So and I think it's very cool. Actually, I don't have I don't have Facebook. You can call me whatever you want to call me. But um, for some reason, I don't like Facebook. I don't know how to explain uh, but it's okay, you know, like if you want to put Facebook right there, that's fine. Uh, I really believe that it's not the best option to put in the TV, but that's fine. The installation process is always the same. So you hit install, you install the application, and then we run it, we open it, and then you can see it's working. So I hope this video is helpful for you. So as you can see right now, I am in the sign in section so i hope this video helped you a lot for what you needed thank you for watching and see you on my next video thanks for your support